Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Tony'sPicks.com. I'm Tony T. Time for an NHL three pack here from Ron Scott. You can find him over at Tony'sPicks.com. Put up great numbers here. Come off a winning day in the NHL and a monster performance in college hoops the past 14 and a half months. Bring him in right now. Ron, how's it going? Yeah, we had the king, okay, and that's uh, what it was about. I mean, why don't I can't figure this team out? Looking good here last couple of games, but hopefully this will be uh, where we're headed. But Kings look good, and we're going to preview this NHL card because the hockey is not stopping on Thursday night. Big card. Nope, we're getting closer and closer here to the playoffs here, and teams making their run here. Boy, the wild outside the, uh, outside looking in. It was not a good result for them. You know, Vegas and the Kings can breathe a little easier tonight, but let's go ahead. Let's get underway here with our NHL three-pack here for Thursday's action. We begin here with the Jets and Devils here. Uh, Jets, $1.25 on the road, total of six. Yeah, you gotta love what the Jets continue to do right now. Uh, what a story that would be if the Jets could do something, considering their, uh, you know, their attendance woes, and uh, maybe they're just lost in the shuffle. I'm not saying they're a, a cup cup contender, but they're sure looking good right now. One for their last five, five and one, last six on the road, and this series has been dominated by the Jets uh, for the last half a decade or so. Uh, they've won 11 of the last 13, so more than that. Uh, 11 of the last 13 over New Jersey, won six of the last seven trips here um, over the last uh, uh, six or seven years. Really great job by the Jets. So New Jersey's lost seven of their last 10. Uh, Winnipeg, they're up five and a quarter units on the road this year, and I got the Devils uh, down nearly nine units at home. So I think the Jets are a worthy favorite, and I'll lay the price here with Winnipeg at New Jersey on Thursday. All right, Ron Scott getting his best bets over at Tony'sBakes.com. Jets and Devils. He likes the Devils. Let's talk back to Jets. The Jets here at yeah. minus the 125. All right, let's continue here on our NHL rundown. Looking for Ron's best bets? Well, just click the link in the description, and you'll get over there, and you'll see the promo code Tony T at checkout. We'll save you that 20% off. All right, let's continue here on our NHL rundown. We go to the 9 o'clock Eastern hour here uh, for our next pick here from Ramon here for his three-pack on this uh NHL card. Uh, we'll get to it here in just a second. Nine o'clock Eastern is what we're looking for, and we got to it here. Sabres and Oilers going head to head. Oilers two eighteen total of six. Yeah, Oilers big uh, favorite here, certainly two dollars. But hey, I'm never you know the Sabres do a nice job on the road. They're not horrible at making a little money here. So uh, I'm not gonna. The fiddle with the side here is a, a play on the show, but I'm, I'm going to look at the total, certainly. Especially Edmonton doing a pretty good job uh, defensively, and their games are starting to be, you know, we maybe know them as high scoring, maybe from earlier in the season. As always, uh, Edmonton, really, but not right now. Uh, Edmonton's gone under in six of their last seven. The Sabres have gone under in six of their last eight. The Sabres have gone under in nine of their last ten on the road. They played back on uh, March 9th uh, was 3-2 in that one. Tony uh, Buffalo got the win at home, and the series has gone under in six of the last seven. So I'm going to go under with the Sabres and the Oilers here, East versus West, on Thursday night. All right, well, Scott, you find us in place over at TonySpeaks.com. Sabres and Oilers. He likes Sabres and Oilers under total of six goals. All right, let's continue here on our NHL rundown. Of course, don't forget that promo code Tony T at checkout. We'll save you that 20% off. Next up here on our NHL three pack, we go to the uh, 1030 Eastern time frame here. It's uh, looking at the Vegas game here. We got it right now. It will be the uh, Kraken and Golden Knights going head to head on ESPN. Uh, Golden Knights, $1.92, total of six. Yeah, dare I say the rugged uh, Pacific Division. Tony, a lot of unders with the division right now. Any game not involved, the Sharks. Uh, uh, seems to get an under right now it seems like with the, in these two teams you know a series has gone under in five of the last six seattle's gone under in nine of their last 12 division games vgk's gone under in seven of their last eight and uh, uh in the division seven of the last eight in the division make that clear I'm trying to i try to set up the theme and i messed it up but uh, no doubt part of the a Pacific Division under situation here, Tony. When these when the teams are clashing uh, in the division, Golden Knights also fourteen and twenty. 
to the under at home Kraken 16 and 25 to the under as a dog these are kind of the things I look at in hockey Tony because uh, you know the game's always going to finish somewhere between you know four five six or seven so trends are heavy for me always uh, in the NHL and uh, I'm going to be going under here with the Kraken and the Knights. All right most Scott get his premium place over at TonySpace.com Kraken and the Golden Knights go under total here of six goals. All right, let's continue here on our NHL three pack. We got through it, and now it's time to take a look at TonyStricks.com for Ramon's action here on Thursday. You can see the great results for Ramon here in the uh, in college basketball for the past two two years. It's about 14 and a half months, 2023 and 2024. Uh, come off a winning day here on uh, Thursday. Uh, looking for a, a big day here, for, uh, of course, obviously here on NCAA tournament as it opens up here on uh, full blown 16 game mode here for Thursday and Friday. What do you have going over at the site? Well, likely a seven pack in college basketball. I'd imagine we'll have a package of at least three games in the NBA and also a three game, maybe a five game package in college uh, in the NHL. Also, uh, we we. That baseball package over baseball picks over the last couple of nights, Tony, as well as we get ready for the opener next week. But right now, this is it. This is the moment. Hopefully, you're seeing this in plenty of time. I and mean, this is our hockey preview, but this is time for uh, NCAA March Madness starting tomorrow. The the big, the real madness that every, that every casual fan gets involved. We know our, our viewers are, uh, you know, sophisticated, but they also might be uh, also learning a little bit. So why not check me out over at Tony'sPicks.com. All the picks are documented. All my picks are uh, listed there, and I've had a pretty good run since joining Tony on the site. College basketball is my best sport. I'm on top of all the leaderboards pretty much uh, long term in college basketball, and also I'm eating up here uh, on a daily basis as well, putting together a kind of a winning streak here. Tony six and three, all sports combined last night. We've already turned in some big, big days over the last seven days here, as you know. So uh, this is it for me. I'm loading up the play. As soon as I get done with Tony, I, everything's finalized here on my big uh, sheet. Got all my brackets in, and I'm going to load up the premiums because I'm ready to go after a pretty good night. We had some pretty good winners uh, in the action already. A couple of winners we've turned in here uh, in the NCAA tournament so far with those play-in games, and I'll be firing away on Thursday and Friday, so you can grab a three-day or a seven-day or even a 30-day all-sports pass, get Major League Baseball. I'll be going uh, – I'm not waiting. I'll be there opening day 2.0, Tony, uh, firing away on Major League Baseball and a huge card there, too. So you can roll with me all month if you want. We'll go all the way to the national championship game together. Who's going to make it? Uh, we'll be there, though, with picks along the way. Uh, please check out the handicapper leaderboards in college basketball. See who's hot. A lot of other great cappers, they're hot, too. You can roll with them, but... Uh, my record speaks for itself. There it is right there, over 57 units uh, in the last uh, 15 calendar months here in college basketball. Those are based on $100 plays. They're mostly uh, sides and totals. So uh, up 57 units, Tony, betting minus what, probably 110, 105 to 110 on average. I don't have that research, but uh, we know how we do it here at Tony's Pitch. We try to keep it kind of close to uh, that even number to give you a real good value for your dollar, okay, when you're baking picks. Uh, we don't want $2 favorites out there. I'm dealing sides and totals, mostly the ones you can get the most money down, the biggest limits, the biggest bets. And if you're subscribing to the picks, uh, I want you to play the picks with confidence to cover our costs, if you will, you and I, you're my subscriber, if you will, subscribers. And uh, make sure that we cover that because we're gonna uh, we're gonna win, but we got to make sure that we get our money's worth. And the longer package you get, the less the plays cost. But I'm still gonna throw in some great packages tomorrow, Tony. Surely a seven pack in college basketball, and use that promo code Tony T at checkout to save twenty percent. I'm gonna make it very very affordable because hey. There's only uh, two days all year where we have this kind of uh, college basketball tournament action, the one that everybody loves, packs the uh, sports books, the sports bars, and, well, even down here in the bunker, Tony, I'm not going anywhere on Thursday and Friday. 
That's right, guys. You got Russell Bowen Scott over at TonySpeaks.com. You see the great results here from college basketball uh, for 2023 and 2024. It's almost 15 months now. Uh, so go ahead and get signed up with Ramon. Now, when you click the link in the description, you'll land right here on Ramon's Handicapper page. Scroll down, you get the one-day passes or get the long-term passes. Remember, the one-day passes are profit guaranteed. They must turn a profit or the amount you purchase is credited back to your account for site credits. That's profit guaranteed. It's not so on the long-term passes because those long-term passes sold at quite a discount. When you consider how much volume Ramon puts into the system, it's a really good value there. The long-term passes better value than buying the place individually and of course that one month pass is a good value they're taking the entire NCAA tournament so all these minor tournaments that are in action too NIT CIT CBI as well and of course that one month pass will take you right through the end of the NBA regular season into the playing round through the end of regular season NHL three weeks of baseball remember U.S. opening day March 28th so as you're watching this uh, on on Thursday it'll be a week away that'll be opening day U.S. a week from today uh, so uh, go ahead and get on board here uh, with Ramon Scott. Get that one month pass, or if you want, it, you can shorten it to seven days if you want. You'll, you'll get the you'll, you'll get the tournament games until we, they, we knock them down to to to, uh, to uh, the Sweet 16. But anyway, great value there. But whatever you do, use that promo code Tony T at checkout, and you'll save 20 percent off. You can access Ramon's page by clicking the link you see there in the description, and you'll get right right on his page and go ahead and get signed up. All right, Ramon also. I've shot college basketball and an, in, and an NBA three-pack, so make sure you like and subscribe and look for those videos and get alerted when these videos are dropped. And of course, when you like the videos, well, it just tells the algorithm that you want to, you want the place, so you'll, you'll get you'll get alerted. That's really how it works. Hit those likes, and then notifications work better that way. All right, Ramon, I'm Tony. We'll talk to you guys later.